Another turning point, a fork stuck in the road. Time grabs you by the red direction where to go. So make the best of this test and don't ask why. It's not a question but a lesson learned in time. It's something unpredictable, but in the end it's right. I hope you had the time of your life. Take the phone. We made it to camp. I have the van back there. We're gonna set up camp. I also have a fire ring and the table and the barbecue grill. There's water, there's toilets, there's flies. There is a guy whacking some weeds <laughs> in the background. I hope it doesn't come out too much, but it is what it is. This is a paid campsite, so US Forest Service is here. Normally during the summer, these campsites are a little bit too close for my liking, but right now, because it's the middle of the week and it's still a bit cold, there's very few campers here, which is what I like. There's also not a lot of cell signal, which is also a bonus because I get to enjoy the full experience without being on my phone too much. And later on, we're gonna make a fire and I'm also gonna cook a delicious meal over the campfire. But for right now, let's set up camp.
You know, I always wondered why fire rings have rocks in them. Well, now I know. Still cold outside, hence the fire. Don't mind the tears, it's just the smoke in my face. But a stool like this, it's the spot every time. This time I went a little wild and I got some of those uh, vegan Italian style sausages. Mmm. 
smoke in the face, like I said. The flavors though, oh man. Mm. Plus, cooking over the campfire tastes so much better for some reason. Since I was gonna make a campfire anyway, I didn't have to use any electricity, I didn't have to use any propane or butane, and I'm still gonna be able to enjoy this campfire for a little bit longer to keep me warm and just uh, relax.